great eyes. This is a secret for your mommy for Mother's Day. You're going to choose. You can do the one that Miss Thompson is going to show you, or you can do this one. It's really easy, and it looks super complicated. This is one using yellow paper, and this is using white paper. So I'm going to show you how to do this one, because you've probably only got white paper at home. And that's what it's going to look like. It's going to be a present for your mom. Let's put that over here. So you're going to print this out, and if you don't have a printer... You can just draw these petals and then you're going to let's color them in first so let's do the leaves this is going to be a leaf and this is going to be a leaf and there's some veins on the leaf that and then a cute little trick is to make this part dark like that and then take a light color that's my dark green now I'm going to switch over to a light green and color in the lighter green so your leaf has got two colors a light green and a dark green you need two leaves and you need six petals. And the same with the petals. Let's do the strap going down the middle. And then do some little dots on each petal. And then the same as we did, just to make it more interesting with the leaves, use a dark color first and then a lighter color as you go along. So I'm going to start with my red, just like that, on each petal. And then I'm going to go to orange and yellow. It's going to go from dark to light. Maybe I should have used some purple. Purple's even darker than red. Like there, I used purple, red, pink, orange, yellow. So you can use any colors you like. But I think this looks really nice. There we go. So there's my red. Now my orange. Like little hairy bits going from the pointy end towards the middle of your petal. Like that. I'm doing it fast, but you can take your time. That's my second color. You can do as many colors as you like. And now some yellow. I'm going to leave the middle bit white on this one. As you can see here, I colored the whole petal in. I'm using cookies because it's nice and dark. And this one. And now I'm ready with my petals. It's time to cut. It's easier if you can print onto colored paper already. Because then half the job is done for you. But now it's time to cut everything out. neat as you can. Thumbs on the top. I'm going to 
beat all of this up. Now, you take your glue and you put a little bit of a little blob round about here. Just a small blob of glue like that. And you put your just the tip of your petal. Whoops, not that one. Into the glue. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Now it's glued right in the middle there. And you take some more glue and you put it on the end here. Like that. And then stick that onto the paper so it squishes up the petal it makes it very three-dimensional and fancy looking your mom is going to love this or your granny or whatever it is that you're going to make it for you can keep it a secret and give it to them on sunday see how easy it is Okay, now that's done. Take your green and you make a nice stem. Nice thick stem like that. And you stick your leaves on. One goes here. One goes here. And then bend it some glue just on the end squash it in like that same on this one there we go and then you can write a message to your mom if you want to you can write I love mom I love mom, exclamation mark. And if you want to, there it is. If you want to make these little hairy bits, then you can also cut this part out. But you don't have to do this part. This is optional. Let's cut it through there as well. Cut it in half. You might want to put a little bit of color on the end. Then all you do is fold it in half and put a little bit of glue on here and stick that in the middle. This is a bit tricky, you don't have to do this part. Stick that down, a little bit on this one, stick that one, make it stand up. Bend that a bit, bend that, and you can put as many as you like. And it's as easy as that. You have a lovely picture to give to your mom.
I say thank you for everything that you do for me and I love you and I appreciate you. Let's squash that down. You can even curl it a little bit with your fingers. And that's it. I love you, Mom. Beautiful picture for your mom.